taking a look at the My state. Media? Um, what we have for Saturday, it's going to be about 30 degrees out in DIA and in Denver. Um, but it's going to be a cold one across the board as it's going to be about 30 degrees. And also, in, uh, if you're going out for the games in Durango, uh, 50 degrees and 25 for the low. So it's not going to be too warm, but bring your coats. And for Sunday, it's even going to get colder. Uh, 20 degrees across the board, um, 21 out in Denver, and a low of 8 degrees. And even in DIA, it's a little bit colder. 17 degrees for the high and a low of 5. So bring sure to bring your coats if you're going out that way. And what, why it's bringing it in is because we are going to have a high pressure system coming from North Dakota. And the high pressure system is going to bring in the cold temperatures and also in the cold front um, that's coming from Canada is going to bring it in that precipitation. And in that uh, low front, but for Sunday, it's not even going to, it's going to be a little bit coming with that snow and also you're even going to see that the high pressure system is, is going to move that cold front and it should be not too bad. And that uh, looking out on the five day forecast, um, it's still going to be in the 30s throughout the week, but we could see even a bigger storm on Thursday at 37 degrees. So we be better be ready for that. So if you're going to go out this weekend, be safe and might want to stay in by the fire. Yeah, as we were saying earlier, today's that last day, 50 degrees. Go on the walk, enjoy the nice weather, but then tomorrow and the rest of the weekend, it's going to get in that blizzard weather again. Yeah, definitely. Stay at home, watch some Netflix. Yeah, absolutely. It's that, as we were saying, it's that homework weekend, yeah. so enjoy it today, and then back into Colorado weather. And be sure to check out online so our updates. Yeah, absolutely. MyMetMedia.com. Be able to check out all of our updates for all the weather stuff. Stick with us after the break for EMA as Melanie Townsend shares important details for foodies and fashionistas.